how you doing guys right now we are going to create a migration file for our database tables remember in Laravel you don't go to the database to create tables directly you're going to create them from a file here if you go to um, this is the folder of my app if you go to this database folder click on migrations you're supposed to create a file here if the file is created then you can run a command in your command prompt and um, looking for my command prompt so once we run a command here it will automatically go create the database for us all right so but we don't create in manual in laravel you don't create that file manually you have to create it from here so open your command prompt and type php artisan serve sorry php artisan make migration then you give the name of the migration uh, we are trying to create a migration for a qr code table so uh, all your tables in laravel must be plural so we're going to do create uh, qr code oops create underscore qr code table this is how you create you name all your migration files look at this you have create underscore users table create underscore that's how you do that so what is inside here is the name of the table we're dealing with so uh, create qr code table i'm just trying to expand this to make sure that you can see it very well hit enter we're going to create two tables in our database we're trying to make this app to be as small and um, straightforward as possible all right we want it to have a small footprint and then powerful does exactly what it uh, says it does no fancy designs so no fancy features so we just want people to be able to request for a qr code and then um, put it on their website their users come and initiate the transaction and complete the transaction period that's just what we want so we have this qr code we're going to create another one this process may take them um, two or three uh let's say about 10 15 seconds then we have to create another um, table migration for the transactions okay we're good we now have to create the second one which is for the transactions so to pull up what you typed before like i just did uh, once you're on the command window like this you press the up arrow key on your keyboard to pull up what you have before so i can come here and press transaction so that's the transactions table that we need Hit enter um usually 10 15 seconds it will be done if yours is hanging just type any keys on your keyboard so that it will open up okay cool now we're gonna do it for the last one which is rows because we need to have user levels we need to have the admin we need to have the normal uh, website owners and then we need to have um, users normal purchasers or buyers customers we also need to have moderators people that manage the platform so we can have that press on so to do that we have to create a rows table rules so which means for the next four or five videos we'll be uh, typing out the migration code for these uh, files that we created so we created three files and um, i believe that's enough so see in the next video where we'll jump into qr code straight up and start uh, creating out the migration files